Do you happen to have a boat that maybe doesn't work or is just in bad shape and you're ready to get rid of it? Well, the city is giving you a chance to do that legally and for free. Sunrise reporter Roland Rodriguez is live in Flower Bluff this morning with information on how you can get it all done. Roland, tell us about it. Hi, right, good morning, Jen, and good morning, South Texas. Not only are they taking boats, but they're also taking wave runners and jet skis. And today, this morning at 9 a.m., the city's vessel, Turn Your Vessel In program starts, and it'll run to about 4 o'clock, and it'll go, actually go through Saturday. The second annual vessel turn-in program is designed to provide owners with a voluntary free method for the disposal of unwanted boats. Inoperable boats or illegally sunken boats can cause environmental damage to uh, the surrounding waterways and also makes it dangerous for boat operators to navigate waterways if they're inside or sunken in the water. So it's also a free and legal way to dispose of these boats. The boats will be delivered to the drop-off point where it will be verified that each qualifies for disposal and all hazardous materials such as fuel, oil, and batteries will be removed and the vessel will be destroyed. We do require uh, required documentation that you're the owner or that the vessel belongs to you. Um, if you go by cctexas.com, you see the qualifications for those paperwork, and you can bring that by with you. The program is for boats less than 26 feet long. Longer boats may be accepted on a case-by-case -case basis. They may even help you find a way to drop it off, too. Well, that's correct, but if you contact us, we can uh, figure out a way to bring it there, maybe by getting you in contact with the towing company to drop it off here. Last year, more than 30 vessels were destroyed, and with Hurricane Harvey pounding the Texas coast, those numbers are expected to double. Uh, that is correct. That's why we brought more uh, equipment here to handle that in case we do have an influx of boats and, and trailers that we need to dismantle. But it's a, a need, and this is going to be a continued need necessity throughout the years to come. Again, this program is free for those in the city and those in the surrounding cities as well. Of course, you would like more information on this project. All you have to do is visit our website at KRISTV.com. Reporting live from 201 Jester here in Flower Bluff, Roland Rodriguez, Chris, 6 News.